Hey. Hey. Hey, guys. You're still here. It's good to see you guys. I can't believe you're still hanging in there. Welcome back to the garage. It has been a minute and I am sorry, but uh, we're all alive and well, and the race cars are still here. Y'all are probably wondering like, where's the new car? Where's all the videos, Tom? Where's the new Mollus? Like hurry up, make some Mollus content. We're getting there and it is still coming. Pretty much what is going on is my uh, ambitions being a little bit high versus actual reality. I wanted to have this car in my hands. I wanted to have a lot of progress made on it and I wanted to get it onto the track right away in the 2023 season. And uh, reality is it's much easier said than done. At the time of this recording, I'm supposed to have the new Mullis Dragster in my hands in about a month, maybe a little bit more than a month. It's looking like late January, early February timeframe. My wife got me a new coat. Got me a new coat for Christmas. Thank you, wife. I love it. It's amazing. I wish I would have had it like for this last two weeks. You guys, we have positive temperatures today. That's why I'm out in the garage. I'm like, it's positive temperatures. I need to come and I need to come and be with the race cars for a little bit. Positive four today. So the new Mullis is on the way. I'm psyched about it. And honestly, you guys, I told them, I, like my words were no hurry on my car because of everything that they're doing for me. Glenn, Toby, the entire team over at Mollus Race Cars, uh, thank you so much for being such a huge part of both Golf Star Bracket Races and Golf Star TV. It's immensely thankful for what you guys are doing for me and uh, can't wait, just can't wait to get my hands on the car. I've been working on some renderings for uh, what I kind of envision for the aesthetic on the new race car. Uh, obviously, this isn't final, final, final or anything, but I do have an option A and an option B that I want to show you guys. I'm going to throw it up on the screen. Boop. think please please give me some feedback down in the comments what's your jam option a or option b uh you know we may land somewhere between option a and option b i uh, may you know who knows it might change dr drastically i don't think so though these these are kind of the the scheme and the and the colors that i'm feeling this is kind of where i'm heading with this thing but i'd love to see what your guys' thoughts are what your feedback is um, I still have a lot of work to do on these renderings, but I just wanted to give you a little sneak peek. Just wanted to sprinkle, just give you a little bit, just a little something about the, uh, the Mullis content here that has been severely lacking. Parts are starting to come in for the new dragster, and I do have something I want to show you guys today. Uh, problem is I gotta, I gotta go outside. <laughs> it's cold. <laughs> Look at this, dad already tried to open it. I made him close it back up. You can't do that without a camera. Ooh, it's the Gall Star. Back into the tundra. Yep, yeah, baby! And now, my hands are frozen. 100% gonna have to put this down here. We'll pull it out so you guys can see what's up. One of the first pieces of the puzzle coming in for the new Mullins Race Cars Dragster. Oh, baby. You guys, this is new. This is like new to the market. This is a variant of something very cool that is not available on the market but will be by the time that you see this video. Okay, so this is brand spanking new. Woo! Yeah, baby! Oh man, you guys already know what it is. You already know what it is. What else is in here? And the tray. Sticker! 
You guys, this is a brand new scoop design from Innovative Glassworks. Innovative Glassworks is the sponsor of this video. Stick to the end, I'll show you how to save a little bit of coin, but let's take a look at this. I say it's a new design, it is a very familiar looking new design, but it is subtly, very subtly different from the little O, very common design that you see um, on so many dragsters nowadays. We got a plastic situation I'm gonna just have to take care of. I can't talk and do at the same time and I just gotta get a better look at this thing. Wow. You guys, I really, I really like the look of that. You guys, what this is called is the Ultra Lil O. Okay, Ultra Lil O. What you guys are used to seeing is either the Big O or the Lil O design. This is, this is different. This is new, this is subtly different. It's called the Ultra Lil O. What I am told from the boys over at Innovative Glassworks is this is the Ultra Lil O, a brand new design, one inch shorter at the bottom and one inch bigger neck and airflow region. So the shape is subtly different, but I like. Modernized. Fresh look, yet familiar. I'm digging it, I'm digging it. Yeah, baby. Might I add that this fiberglass work, the craftsmanship and the quality here, yeah, I'm impressed. Of course, I got the primer finish, ready to go to paint. Uh, gonna be putting paint on the car, but you can, uh, for an upcharge, you can get single colors. Uh, you can actually get a carbon fiber hydro dip if that's your thing. Um, of course, that's a little bit more money, but right here you're just looking at the primer finish unit. Of course it comes with the tray. I do like the tray. It comes with a nice gel coat finish on it already, so don't have to mess with that. Oh, baby. Let's get Zeus Springs pre-installed, ready to go, and the scoop tray comes with the scoop. When you buy the scoop, it comes with the tray. You do have to put it the right way, apparently. There we go. This is probably a little easier when this tray is mounted on a car. Probably a little easier when it's not four degrees out. Oh my gosh, that's nice. Holes line up perfectly. That is a nice looking design. I like it. I like it a lot. Wife's gonna be mad, already getting the coat dirty. You guys, this is one of the lightest fiberglass scoops available on the market. And might I say, one of the most attractive looking scoops on the market. Again, it's the Innovative Glassworks Ultra Lil O. It just came out, it's fresh, it's new. Highly recommended. Impressed with the quality so far. And uh, you know, they're very affordable. So. Uh, Scoop plus a tray package like you see here, retails for $750. But as I promised, get you a little special something something, save yourself a little bit of coin by using discount code GALLSTAR5. So all you gotta do, head on over to the Innovative Glassworks Facebook page, shoot them a message, shoot them your order, mention GALLSTAR5, and you're gonna be saving a little bit of coin on a very nice, very, very nice update to your dragster this season. I'm liking that. Get yourself the ultra little O, baby. All right, let's get some beauty shots. next for the Golf Star team and the Golf Star channel. We are going to be bringing you that mullus content. It is just slightly delayed. But one thing I can promise you is that I do want to make a ton of content around the build and around the process of finishing that car. With that said, I probably won't have that car on the track early 2023, maybe late 2023, but no promises because I really wanna take my time, I really wanna do it right, I really wanna make it nice, and I really wanna film a lot, which, just makes it take forever. But I wanna bring you guys that content, so that is coming soon. With that said, it looks like 2023, 
There may be one last ride left in the old girl. I thought, I thought it was done. I thought we were over. I thought it was in the past. I had already said my goodbyes. A little tear in my eye. But the old girl gonna be back on the track here in 2023. So we have some things that we need to do to her this winter. I actually hurt the 582 a little bit at the last race here in October. So some updates coming on that. We're gonna be working, doing some valve spring work. We're gonna be maybe putting a different cam in it. I'm not sure if there'll be time or not, uh, but there is some plans in the works. There is some process happening behind the scenes for this old girl. And uh, so I'll be bringing you some of that content here in the next couple videos. Until then, I wanna thank you guys for liking, commenting, subscribing, all the things that you do, visiting the Golf Star TV Swag Shop to help support the creation of more videos like this. Thank you Innovative Glassworks for sponsoring this video. See you guys in the next one. Later.